Hello, my dear students and viewers. Welcome to my channel, Scorpio Class. If you are looking for Class 8 Social Studies Notes of Revised Syllabus 2022, then you are on the right platform and watching the right video as we are going to discuss Class 8 History Lesson, the Cholas and the Hoysalas of Dwara Samutras Question and Answers. And this video is going to give you entire notes of this chapter and it's going to be very informative and helpful for you all. So stay tuned till end and do not miss any part of it. And my dear viewers, if you want all the other lessons notes of social studies of class 8 as well as of English subject, you can visit the description box and find the playlist link where you will find all the videos of the notes. The link will also be shared in the i button above. Now let's get started but before that if you are new to my channel and watching my video for the first time do subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon so that you get the notifications of all the upcoming videos. Let's get started with the first main now we have fill in the blanks. The first one the capital of the Cholas was Dash. Answer is Tanjavur. Next the committee of the villagers in every village during the period of the Cholas was Dash. And it is Mahasabha. Next, the most famous Chola educational center or Agrahara was Dash. And it is Uttara Merur. Next, the temple in Begur near Bangalore built by the Cholas is Dash. And it is the Choleshwara temple. Next, the army of bodyguards during the time of the Hoysalas was Dash. Answer is Garuda. Next, the poetic work written by Raghavanka is Dash. Answer is Harish Chandra Kavya. So we have finished with fill in the blanks. Now let's move to the second main answer the following questions. Question number is continued as per your textbook. And the question is. Who was the founder of the Chola kingdom? Answer. Karaikala Chola was the founder of the Chola kingdom. Next question. Write a note on the significant features of the Chola administration. Answer. The foremost quality of the Chola administration was the development of the self-governance of the village. The Grama Sabhas were the first Sabhas. Tara Kurram was a village. Every Kurram had a village committee named Mahasabha. This was also called Perumuguri and its members were called as Perumakkal. The members were chosen through election. Only Sanskrit scholars and rich people were allowed to stand for election. One sixth part of the land yield was being collected as tax. So these were the administrating features of a Chola kingdom. Next, describe the encouragement given by the Hoysalas to the literature. Answer, Kannada literature flourished immensely. Rudra Bhatta wrote Jagannatha Vijaya. The great poet Janna wrote Yashodhara Charite. Harihara composed the Champu poem Girija Kalyana. Raghavanka authored Harish Chandra Kavya. Keshi Raja wrote Shabdamani Darpana. Even in Sanskrit, memorable works were composed like Sri Bhashya by Ramanujacharya and Parashara Bhatta composed by Shru, Shri Guna Ratnokosha. So these were the literature found in Hoysala's kingdom. So with this question answers, we come to end, end with the notes of this chapter. I hope these answers were helpful and informative for you all. If you find the video informative and helpful and if you liked it, do hit the like button and share it with your friends. Do subscribe to the channel and stay tuned for more such videos. Thank you.